Natalie and welcome back to my channel. So in today's video we're going to be reviewing Wolf Alice's new album Blue Weekend which was released on June 4th 2021. All right so let's head on over to Venice Beach and start chatting about the album. After an unprecedented year and a half, Wolf Alice has composed an LP that harnesses their tumultuous life experience into a powerful exploratory album. Blue Weekend showcases lead singer Ellie Roswell's silky, fervent vocals and presents itself as a pastiche to 90s British alternative rock. The passionate drums, rhythmic tonalities, and intricate guitar backings support this dynamic homage that is derived from various nuanced themes and experiences. The album explores themes of self-worth, individuality, and empowerment after a demoralizing or discouraging experience. The album opens with the song The Beach, which steadily builds from soft, rhythmic guitar acoustics and soothing vocals into a strong, harmonic, orchestral ballad. The Beach segues into Delicious Things, which is a dreamy anthem encouraging individuals to give life all they've got, but acknowledges the loneliness that sometimes accompanies persistent determination to succeed. It's enthusiastic, yet pensive, and possesses lulling instrumentals that imbue a bittersweet sense of happiness. Roswell sings, I I won't say no. I'll give it a go. I, I won't say no. I'll give it a shot for the spot at the top. A girl like me, would you believe I'm in Los Angeles? She wraps up the song with a musing echo, don't lose sight, as a subtle reminder to embrace individuality and self-worth. Lipstick on the glass describes the tempting thoughts that occur when desiring the touch of someone who betrayed you. Forgiveness and regret are two haunting themes propelling this hypnotic composition. Roswell sings, Oh, my body does deceive me, just as did yours. Though we're fighting different wars in our ways, oh, but there's no pleasure in this resisting. So go ahead and kiss me, I take you back. After this hypnotic haunting ballad, Smile jolts into an intense rhythmic jam channeling a funk rock vibe. A poetic rhythmic rhyme is present in the lyrics and fervent instrumentals. These elements are weaved together into a passionate anthem that supports individuality and self-expression, while showcasing disdain for condescending critics. This is one of my favorite songs on this album since it is empowering and widely relatable. Safe from Heartbreak If You Never Fall In Love is a calming angelic song with lyrics backed by light meditative acoustic guitar strings. The band creates a choir of heavenly vocals mixed with wistful lyrics imbuing a wavering sense of joy. The next song on the album is How Can I Make It Okay, which is another one of my favorite songs off this album. It starts out with airy, enchanting percussion and magical vocals that build into a compilation of majestic synths, hypnotic guitar riffs, and calming vocals. This composition has strong thematic elements such as focusing on hope when surrounded by darkness and finding ways to overcome isolation and repression. The song conveys the importance of working together to make the world a better place. Roswell sings, A moment to change it all had life before been so slow. Urgency takes hold, but to live in fear isn't to live at all. So how can I make it okay? I just want you to be happy. Nothing else is as important as that to me. How can I make it okay? Play the greatest hits is another energetic party jam, adding additional variety to the album that is ever so familiar to the ear. This song leads into Feeling Myself and Last Man on Earth, which both recognize the imbalance between idealized masculinity and respected femininity within society. No Hard Feelings contains peppy guitar strings and high-spirited lyrics that imitate regretful forgiveness. Roswell sings, No Hard Feelings, Honey, and We Both Will Take the Win subtly encouraging absolution. The last song on the album is The Beach 2, acting as a bookend to the LP, packaging the collection up with a dreamy, silky smooth bow. All right, well, that's it for today's video. If you've enjoyed today's content, don't forget to like, subscribe, and click that little bell button down below to receive a notification the next time I upload a video. I upload videos every Friday and occasionally on Wednesdays. I hope you have a phenomenal day, and I will see you next time. Bye, guys. I upload videos every Wednesday and, oh no, that's not it. That's not what I do. Ignore that, okay.
All right, well, that's it.